Hi, it's time for another How Did I Quilt That? I'm Marika Broman Derning from My Creative Quilts. This is a wall hanging that I created from a panel of the New York City skyline. The colors are just gorgeous in person. They look nice here, but in real life, they're much more so. So when I looked at it, I decided to do some ruler work in the borders. You can see that in the larger border, I did scallops, and in the black border, I did clamshells. It still needs to be, this quilt still needs to be bound, but you see it went all the way around like that. And then these are the rulers that I used. The round, the arc was for the uh, swags, and then this one is for the clamshell. These are both Westerly rulers from So Steady. So once I had decided on the swag and the clamshells, I had to figure out what I was gonna do with the panel. At first I was gonna use metallic thread, but since I'm still new to my long arm, I didn't want to test it yet. So I just did stars. I did random stars in the sky. And then if you can see closely in the building, you can see I did quilting in the buildings to emphasize windows and walls. I just went along matching colors. I did frequent, frequent color changes because I didn't want the quilting to be too obvious. The quilting itself is a little puffy because I used a wool batting on top of my regular batting to make that pop. And then the part that I really like about this quilt is the water. This took a long time. I just harshly zigzagged around it using matching colors all across. I wanted to give it the illusion of the water moving. So I don't usually mismatch my quilting so much. I don't usually do a lot of heavy quilting on one part of the quilt and not the others. But I like the effect it had for this one. So now I just have to bind it and it's ready. And that's how I quilted this New York City panel.